Yo, what's up, everybody? How's it going? Tis I. I'm back. With some more Yakuza 0 modded. Uh, just before we get started, uh, I ended up uh, last stream finishing off that stream, um, uh, turning off one of the uh, turning off the modded heat actions in the moveset mod. Uh, I went ahead and just started back on before I started stream, so. Um, yeah. Without further ado, uh, let's get going. My goal for today is to try and do most of Kiryu's side quests. Um, I probably won't be able to get through, like, all of them yet, but if I can get through a good majority of them, I am A-OK -okay with that. Um, I was either, it was either I was gonna do the, uh side questing or I was gonna do the pocket circuit stadium and I decided to just just do every other side quest before I do I tackle that because <clears throat> oh boy <laughs> I still got Majima's um I still got Majima's thing now to get through and I think that would be I think that one's uh harder to do so um I might I think I want to do... I want to save Pocket Circuit for later. Um, so yeah, I'm going to just grab a sweater and then we'll get started here. Which I have one right on my back, so I'm going to toss it on. Sell the sweater. Doo -doo. Oh, I still need to watch the last stream and try and pick out some, uh, some clips because the last stream was so fun. <laughs> last stream was kind of amazing, not gonna lie. Uh, okay. Let me go ahead and swap the scene over. Hello? Oh yes, and I have also gotten a haircut, and a I shaved. I, I messed up shaving, so I just shaved the whole thing. <laughs> a little, I just have a little bit of a a stubble, but that's it. Uh, and then yeah, my hair is no longer long and wild. Just preferable, I think, because like it, when when it was getting cut, oh man. Felt like a weight was lifted. It felt that good. Okay. Let us go ahead. I don't. F I don't. F I think this is a good good one to start with, actually, because I don't think we have to fight any, any anybody here. So we'll start with the uh, Yokomichi Silver side quest ah. sub story. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, look at these people! Holy cow! What are we going to do? Hey, you. Yikes! Gee hey. whiz, pal! I nearly peed my, uh... What do you do? What are you doing? Shuffling behind me, uh, ugly knob. Uh, yeah, sorry. I thought I should apologize for bumping into you earlier. Boy, who? Oh, you're that man. No, I should be apologizing for my own careless... I mean, whatever, piss off. Um, sure. Oh? <laughs> Just stare at each other. But wait a second. Could you be un possibly un be unaware of who I am? Hmm? You're asking if we've met before we bumped into each other. If we did, I don't recognize you. Oh, wait a second then. So you really don't know who I am? Willikers, what a relief. I'm sorry, I was rude not to introduce myself. My name is Kyo, but my stage name is Crazy Kyo. I'm a vocalist in a band. Let me guess, the Yokomichi Silvers. Same band that those young punks are excited to see. That looked a little weird, the water reflection. I'm surprised I didn't even notice that there was water there, what the hell? Uh, the same band that those young punks are excited to see. Aren't you guys some kind of legendary Yankee band? Uh, yes, that's us. 
We're doing a street show later. Oh, sorry to bug you before your show. Good luck. Whoa! Where the hell do you think you're going, old man? Or, or wait, please, sir, don't go. <laughs> maybe, maybe you can save me. Save you. What? Are you even hike? What? Are you even hardcore in the slightest? Nope. As a joke, we tried dressing all, all punk at a show. To our shock, we got pretty popular with the Yankee crowd. But now we have to keep up the charade full time. Over time, we gained a fan base of wannabe punks. The y the Yokomichi Silvers became heroes of to the rebellious rebellious youth of Japan. That whole style we just called Yankee now. Huh. So uh, there's no there's more than running to running a band than I thought. So, what did you mean by me saving you? I, uh, actually, I want you to teach me how to be a hardcore hooligan. Teach you to be a Yankee? Yes, you see, for today's event, we also have to do a live panel. Be and greet for the fans. But every, me every member of the Okamichi Sil Silvers, myself included, a law abiding choir boys, we, have, we never even shoplifted. If we were to talk in front of a real Yankee, they'd realize we're, that we're phonies. Big punks, huh? Now that you mention it, the way you talk doesn't match how you dress it at all. At all. If we spoke to our fans, we'd lose all of our credibility and popularity in an instant. Or worse, what if they get revenge on us for fooling them? Okay, but you have to do this. Pa do you have to do this panel thing? Why don't you just skip it? I don't want to do it either, but our agency s says we need to own our speaking skills if you want to stay popular. They're making us do this. We've been avoiding every situation where we might have to talk instead of just performing. But now... Got it. So, you want me to teach you how to behave like a Yankee? So you can talk like one. But why me? Why? Why? Well, that would be because you're my idea of what a hooligan should be. A confident demeanor, a razor-sharp glare, a barbed wire attitude so, that says, touch me and get cut. And yet, you also exude a sense of kindness, a guy who extends a helping hand to the weak, a hooligan with a heart of gold. That's my ideal Yankee. <laughs> well, yeah, I am Yakuza. Kind of. Can you teach us so we don't blow our cover? More than that, I think you can give us... Yankee wisdom that will uh, propel the Yokomichi Silvers to new heights of hooliganism. Please, if we lose this chance, the Yokomichi Silvers may have to break up. You teach me how to carry myself like a true Yankee. Okay, then. I'm not sure how useful I can be, but I'll try. Really? Thank you so much! Oh, I'm so sorry, I didn't catch your name. It's Kiryu. Okie dokie, Kiryu-san. Just give me a second, please. I'll go get the others. Sorry to keep you waiting, Kiryu-san. This is our drummer, Sleazy Tarashi. Hey there, I'm Sleazy- I'm Tarashi. My stage name is Sleazy. I have no experience with the ladies. i never even seen a boob. And this is our basis, Bad Boy Aku. I'm Aku. I'll be just caring for elders. And this is Kiryu-san, who's going to impart our ways of the true uh, of true Yankee-style hooligan hooliganism onto us. Please teach us, Kiryu-san. Hmm. You guys are so polite and proper. I'm starting to wonder if there's anything I could do for you. Oh no! Please don't say that. We're all pretty good guys at heart, so please, help us. In your case, being pretty good guys is the problem. But I did agree to do this, so somehow we have to turn you into guys- Turn you guys into hard edge punks. <laughs> oh, yes, please! Hmm. How can I show you to- How can I show you guys how to be tougher? Mm, well, maybe you could come up with an opening remark for little old me. Your opening remark. Yes, I want to kick off our panel with authority. Being a hooligans, we shouldn't come across as weak or hesitant. 
Please, Kiryu-san. I need a singer of an opening line to let to set the tone. Start your engines. Wanna open with start your engines? Start your engines? Oh, like a racing term. Right. The Yankee movement is inspired by Western gre greasers. They love their wheels. So true. That does go with the Yankee lifestyle, so perhaps I should follow with something like get your you get my pistons pumping, don't you think? Huh. <laughs> That's good. Wouldn't hurt to throw in something like ramming it ram it into overdrive either. <laughs> right, right. I didn't know about that one. I'm so glad we got your advice, Curious Son. Oh, oh, Curious Son! Question mm Hmm. Is it? Well, the agency told me about the fins I uh, but, uh, told me to tell the fans how I spend my days off, when I'm not rehearsing or performing. Your days off, huh? Makes sense that fans would want to know how their heroes lift from day to day. Hiroshi, how do you spend a day's off? Well, I make a habit of getting up bright and early so I can make some pancakes. After breakfast, I take my darling puppy, Chi Chibichan, to the park for our, our midnight morning stroll. And then, we have lunch in the Chick Cafe to rest our feet. On our way home, we do a little window shopping. After that, I binge on the dramas I got on my VCR until bedtime. You just describe a typical girl's day. Oh, sorry. That made it sound like you were a fashionable young woman. I was so surprised. I got intense. <laughs> I'm scared. Oh, no, Kiryu-san. You shouldn't be shout like that. You made Suzy Tarashi cry. That's a bit much, don't you think? Oh, I dear. Should say so should say sorry. Uh yeah, my bad Tron. It's it's alright. I was just startled, I wasn't expecting it uh, expecting it is all. So how about how would I spend my day off? Uh yeah, right. One thing's clear. You can't tell the fans how you really spend your free time. No, I guess not. But then what should I say? What would I be doing instead? On your days off, you spend time fighting fighting from dawn to dusk. Fighting? I don't really get it, but do hooligans fight? Do Yankee have sworn enemies or something? It's not having about enemies. Yankees are always ready to and willing to fight. If two, two punks lock eyes, a fight is on. That's how it is in the mean streets of Kamarocha. And just so you know, fist fighting is considered the most hardcore and cool. Jeepers, what a brutal community. I can't... Take my dog out for a walk on that war zone. Hold on. The dogs that keep punks dogs that punks keep can tend to be fiercely loyal and thirsty for blood. We're often trusty partners in the street fight. Is that right? I can't picture my delicate peepee chan engaging in a kerfuffle like that. <laughs> Boy, am I glad we hit you up for advice, Kiryu-san. The perfect hooligan role model. Kiryu-san. Uh, you're bad boy Aku, right? What's the matter? What'll I say? <laughs> Aku, you didn't get a topic like Karashi. Nope. Agency told him to wing it. He's... He's free to talk about whatever, even though he's practically mute. Bad boy Aku even has a backstory. Locked up in juvenile reformatories from birth, bad boy Aku crushed packs of punks before he even finished preschool. Your agency is trying to fit a square peg in a round hole. Aku's a man of few words with a crazy backstory. What should he talk about to make him sound hardcore? A funny recent event, stay of style, and the time he crushed again. But you think it would be better just to stay quiet? Huh? Stay silent during the panel. What would a discussion about anything be disaster? Yeah. Nope. Aku was told he was free to talk about whatever he wants. That means he's also free to not talk at all. That's true, but... It'd be worse if you were to say the wrong things and wreck his image. From Aku's backstory, I'd... I think he would seem more hardcore if he kept his mouth shut. When you put it that way, that makes total sense. Okay, we'll do that. That boy Aku stays speechless during his part. Sure. Aku, are you good with that? 
Okay. All right. Now we'll go over how you run this whole panel of discussion. Yes, please. Yokomichi Silvers, we're almost ready for you. Oh, it's is it time? Uh, I mean, fine. Ah. Like, sorry. I mean, you can come whenever you're ready. I'll be watching from the audience. Yes, please watch us. We're gonna, we're gonna get, we're gonna hit this hardcore Yankee thing out of the park. <laughs> we're gonna kick ass and, but we're gonna kick ass and stuff. I forgot what voice I gave him. Mm -hmm. Bad boy, Aku. Here they are. Put your hands together for the Yakamichi Silvers. Yoko, Yoko Michi Silvers. Woo! Crazy Kyo-san! Bad boy Aku over here! Oh, check out Crazy Kyo's original ESP guitar! Smoking Rad Style! SRS! Smoking Rad Style! The man's got the Yankee look nailed! Wow. They are popular. When they when they're not talking, do they look like real greasers? Up in wet high rock and roll after school. Trashi Aku hit it, boys. Welcome to the mind of a different kind. Where are we been? <laughs> and that concludes today's performance by the Yokomichi Silvers. During their songs, I can see why Yankee kids across Japan look up to Crazy Ko's band. Now we'd like to move on to a special meet and greet panel, a uh, meet and greet panel discussion with the band members. Whoa! No way! Crazy Ko's sons, are you gonna talk to us? That's totally mental. I can't fucking wait to hear Bad Boy Aku's voice. Here's where it gets real. They better pull this off. Yo, Grease Hounds! For the Yokomichi Silver, start your engines! Yeah! Crazy Kaiosan! Pull your jets, bros! But I ain't got it! I ain't got I got a hand to Crazy Kaiosan! He knows how to rev us up and kick us into top gear! He's totally fucking ace! Thanks for uh, thanks for coming out and rocking to our tunes. We love you all. Romantic Revels. You were you romantic rebels. You punks get my pistons pumping. Right here, under the hood. I love you like my turbo drive. Uh! Good. The fans are eating it up. Forming with racing terms, fade off. Awesome. Thank you, Crazy Kaio chan Next, we'd like to hear from Lizzie Tarashi and Bad Boy Aku as well. First up, Lizzie Tarashi san. Here's a question we got from a fan. How do you usually spend your days off? Bruh, me? If I get a day off, I spend it fighting mostly. Teacher Tarashi's a beast, man! Fighting like it, it's exercise to him. Too wicked for words. Oh shit! I would pray to get my ass kicked by Tarashi son. Even just once. Just so you know, I don't allow nothing but go and bare knuckle in a brawl. It ain't a fist, it ain't a fight. Yeah! Good. The fans are eating it up. I knew spending all day fighting would rev up these punks. Thank you, Suzy Tarashi. And to close it out, it's time for Bad Boy Akusan to say a few words. That was it? No way, he just stood there for the whole panel discussion. That's... That's... Eh. Holy crap! Rabbi Aku's the coolest! What a rebel! He doesn't play by the rules! Not even his own rules! That's what make him, makes him bad boy Aku. He rules! Good. It was the right decision to let, let the quiet Aku speak. After all, he doesn't... Like... Big, big talk, I doesn't take big talk to a big man. Attitude speaks louder than words. Kiryu-san, were you watching? 
Yeah, I saw everything. Good work. Here you sound. We tried to apply what you learned from what you... From what... From about the ways of the Yankee to our panel. The fan response was fabulous. I'm still uh, in shock. Yeah, it seemed that way. You guys learned well. I'm proud of you all. Seems like the... Looks like the Yokomichi Silvers will... Have to keep shooting up towards stardom in the uh, spotlight of speed. Tell you big time, curious sound. You have a wild shirt. Well, that was the most fun I ever had speaking in public. Curious on. Thanks. From now on, we're gonna keep working hard to expand on what you taught us. About the way of the Yankee. We'll work on our speaking skills as well. Keep an eye on us, curious son. Yokomichi Silvers are kicking it up with another uh. gear. Yeah. Give it your best shot. We will! People have all kinds of challenges to face. At least those guys are diligent. They should survive a rough road of, of the entertainment world somehow. Don't give up, Yokomichi Silvers. Yay! We did it! Okay. Uh, with that, let's go ahead and head to an eatery because I am low on HP. Like a fool. Oh, that's that's Popo. I don't want to go to Popo. We got the yeah. We got the. I quest in Mataraja. We got we got this one here. Oh god. I don't like that. I don't like that one. We got we got to do it, but I I'm not a big fan of that one cuz it's just it's creepy. What are all the things? Thank you, Korean barbecue. Or is this the beep bowl? Stop, I forget. Let me actually look at it. Yeah, okay, Korean barbecue. I was right. I remember my Kamurocho. Alright. This is the building that has... Mr. Moneybags, right? I'll find out. Oh, it isn't. Oh, we also gotta look for these, too. God dang it. There's so much to do. So little time. Oh, no, there he is. I was right. Oh, God. <clears throat> it's you again. Oh, I didn't catch your name during our little money scattering encounter before. It's Kiryu. You always hang around this place? Oh, yes. When I'm in Japan, I travel the world a lot. So I don't get who uh, spent on much time here. You don't ever go home. Oh, I'll go home soon. On my next trip overseas. We live in another country. I guess when you're rich, that's an option. Oh, no, no. I live in a jumbo jet. A jumbo jet? Oh, uh -huh. well, think of, think of it like a mobile home. When you're a global businessman, uh -huh, you spend more time in the air than anywhere else. I have several pirate jets, and I switch between them depending on my mood. Uh -huh. <laughs> They're hangered at a different airports all, all around the world. Hangar space is, is at a premium. <laughs> I'm losing my Mickey voice. Oh, my God. Can't do it today. Oh, uh -huh. With the soaring... There we go. There it is. 
A whole Agri space in the, is a premium with the soaring land prices these days. A whole, it, so it cost me an arm and a leg, haha. -ha. There it is. Anyway, I guess you should. I guess you should. You should say this place serves as my office while I'm in Japan. Welcome to the investment fund, Kiryu-kun. Investment fund? You want to know how I earned my wealth? Don't, didn't you? Yeah. This is maybe booming right now, but there's too many people earning more money than what they know what to do with. You must have a few tricks up your sleeve. Oh, well, this is how it's done. I just sit here enjoying a drink. And waiting for the phone to ring, that's it. Sorry, I don't follow. You tell me a little more. Sure, but it might take a while to explain. You want me to go on? Please, fill me in on the details. <laughs> okay, but let me warn you. This is... <clears throat> okay, but let me warn you. This could get long. Feel free to zone out if you want to. If you... It won't get you in trouble later. Oh, first, the investment fund raises capital from customers who have extra savings stashed away. Then, pay invest this money in people engaged in business. So that we... Uh, feel... That we feel shows promise. The return of a portion of the profits we gain to our investors. Oh, in other words, we just juggle money around. The people we led to, to all do the real work. So you're basically a money lender. Yeah. Well, not exactly, ho-ho. <clears throat> well, not exactly, ho-ho. Money lenders profit through the interest they charge. But we make our money by investing all manners for all manner of things. We put our money into whatever gets us a return. A list of stocks, to startup companies, movies, productions, and even horse racing. Ho -ho. It, when I do the Mickey voice, it like, I do the ho ho to like set it up. And then like, I'm able to, there's something that happens in my throat that like, it like turn it like switches on. And then I'm able to do it consistently, but like, Sometimes right now, like, I think my throat's a little messed up. Because it's, like, not activating when I do the ho oh So I'm like, okay, let me... <laughs> let me try again here. Uh, you can call that investing if you want, but it sounds a lot like gambling to me. <clears throat> oh, we bet to win, my boy. It, it didn't activate there, but... My boy! Oh, although we use other people's money, a failed investment gains us nothing. So we don't just throw the cash at any old venture. We do our best to ensure we lend money to businesses with solid potential for a return. You make it sound easy. Oh, well, finding the right people to invest in is no simple task. But they're out there if you know where to look. In fact, I found one right here. Here? You, Kiryu-kun. I hear you started up a respectable business of your own in Kamurocho late recently. Whoa, you really have your ear to the ground, huh? Oh, how's it going? Any problems with the cash flow? Not really. I completed the side quest already. Did you know I hired a chicken? Hard, hard to say. To be honest, I could be doing well or added for Rocky Waters. I wouldn't know either way. <clears throat> That's only to be expected. So, Kiryakun, you have two choices laid before you. Choices? You could boost your finances by contributing money to our fund. Or by accepting... An investment from us. The choice is yours. Huh? I understand why you'd want me to invest, but you're also offering to put money into my business. Oh! -ho! Oh, of course! Through the money... Though, although the money will actually be ours, it'll be from someone contrib contributing to the fund. And who would that be? We've adopted a rather unique system for investment fund. We shall call it a mutual investment trust. Okay. Oh, but simply, whether investing is or being invested in, the money, uh, the funds are exchanged between predetermined parties. For example, let's say you contribute to the fund. We invest the money to a business of ums, ems, of uh, I can't say M and Mickey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Emson and Son Mori. If Emson. Then, then use the money in a successful business venture. A percentage of that of the profit would come back to the fund. 
That's pretty standard. Yeah, makes sense. The difference is, what happens next? Uh, the difference is, what is, what happens next? If Emson then contributed to the fund, your business would be given priority to its investment. Emson originally made a profit through your contribution, so you would be rewarded for that, don't you think? So when I put in money, it only goes to this Emson. And when you when I take a cash injection, it's always from him too. <clears throat> That's right, you catch on quickly, ho. Hmm. Then why do we need to go through the fund? <clears throat> oh, hmm? Yeah. Well, wouldn't it be quicker for Emson and me just to exchange money directly? <clears throat> oh, come now, come now, Kiryu kun How on earth would you find someone you could entrust with that kind of money? Our fund is, has all the connections to ensure that investments only go to trustworthy parties. That means you can contribute without fear of putting your money at risk. You have a point. I have to admit, I know next to nothing about investing. Oh, yeah, you're far better off using our fund to send money to Amazon. Okay, I get the picture. Whew. So... Who would Emson be in my case? <clears throat> oh, we have candidates all over Japan. I'm in the face of the fun here in Kamurocho. And we have a representative, Sombori Osaka. Sombori, huh? I hear the nightlife industry is really booming over there. The cabaret clubs and the like. Oh, that would, be pro that would probably be a good area to invest in now. So you're saying that money I contribute would probably go to someone running a cabaret in Sword and Bori, huh? If you didn't get the hit earlier. Oh, so. uh -huh. and the reverse is also true. Any co money contributed to the individual in Sword and Bori would come to you in Kamurocho. However, we take a cut of our commission, so you wouldn't get the full amount. That's just the way it is. That about sums it up, I guess, so. Mm. I... I think I get how this system works. As a gesture of goodwill, let me make a little contribution to your business, Kiryakun. Nani? You sure you want to give me all this? <laughs> Use that money to make your business thrive and make a profit. Invest any extra cash you have with us. Like I said in the beginning, we're just. We just juggle. We just juggle money. Our business relies on the people using the fund. Okay, understood. Mm. Oh, I flew first class to try it out the other day. But you know when they put you next to, to a complete stranger? The nerve, I'll just take the plane on my- uh, I'll just take my own plane next time. Thank you very much. Never mind that. Welcome to the investment fund. How can we help you today? I want to invest some money. Like to <clears throat> oh, you'd like to contribute money to Emson and Sonambori? Okay, how much? How about you put up 10 million and just start? Huh? You mean it's a set amount? For new investors, it's better to set a limit. Once you get used to things, I'll raise the amount a little at a time. I get that there has to be a limit, but why the fixed. Why the, is the amount fixed at 10, 10 million yen? And I just start a normal with a normal small investment. How small? One yen? Two? Tiny investments like that won't lead to any profit. What's the point? Uh, well, it's just... 10 million yen, okay? Fine. Good. Where right, were we then? Time to make your contribution is 10 million yen. Are you ready to invest? Oh, okay. Now we're in business. I'll deduct 15% commission and send the rest of the Ensign. Hopefully, he'll make good use of it. 15%? Is that all? You gave me 10 million yen to start with. So, aren't you taking a big loss? Oh, uh -huh. I'm not worried at all. The money will find its way back to me eventually. You just focus on your business, Kiryu-kun. If you say so. 
You mean next time? <clears throat> well, next time I'll drop my commission to 10%. Come back when you have some more money burning in your hole. Burning a hole in your pocket. Burning in your hole. Like, I said that completely wrong. I carry you. Bye, Mr. Moneybags. What a guy. What is... What is this one? I guess we'll find out. Hey there. Want some mushrooms? Huh? Mushrooms? <laughs> I've got some great ones. Guaranteed to put a smile on your face. What do you say? Mushrooms that'll put a smile on my face. Sorry, I'm not interested in that. Come on, why not give them a try, at least? You won't find finding mushrooms anywhere. Yeah. No, I'm good. Go ask someone else. I see. That's too bad. Hey, you! Is it true you're selling mushrooms here? <laughs> a customer? What kind of mushrooms are you looking for? I've never done them before. I don't know how much, so can you... Can you recommend me something? <laughs> it's rare to find someone new to mushrooms. All the ones I... All the ones I stock are great, but let me think. About enoki mushrooms. They're in season now. Enoki? <laughs> I get it. Just give them regular names so no one catches on, huh? Art. Uh, huh? But enoki is enoki. What do you mean? I'm looking for the kind of mushrooms that'll make me feel good. Well, my enoki mushrooms are top quality. Eat them in a hot spot. And a hop on, you'll feel good, all right. You're making fun of me because it's my first time. I want your face rearranged. No, oh, I'm not making fun of you. I I just don't want my face rearranged. Wait, this mushroom dealer. Boy. Hey, that's enough. I get the feeling that this guy is not the kind of mushroom dealer you're looking for. Huh? I don't get it. And who asked you anyway? Fuck off. Wait, hear me out. You're not gonna shut your mouth. I'll shut it for you. Hold on, give me a second. There we go. Give me that leg. Holy shit. <laughs> that was pretty great. What the fuck? This guy's ridiculous. I don't know how I'm standing like this even though you broke my leg. Ah! Uh, thanks for helping me. Well, I was just defending myself. Oh, you're a lifesaver. Can I ask your name? Miss Kyria. <laughs> <laughs> Curious on, huh? Here, take this as my thanks. Really do show regular mushrooms, huh? That's what I said from the beginning. My mushrooms are guaranteed to put a smile on your face. That's exactly the kind of talk that confuses people. Look, you know where the... You know that there are mushrooms that make you hallucinate when you eat them, right? If you sell mushrooms in the, sh the shady part of town like shady part of town like Camarocho, people are gonna bound to get mixed up. Why don't you sell them else somewhere else? It's just mm -hmm. what is there some reason to do to do it in Camarocho? I want as many as people as po po possible to enjoy my mushrooms. Tokyo is a place to find lots of people. Camarocho especially. Well, you're not wrong about that. Only just started out. 
If I can pack up leave, and leave now, I feel like I failed. I want to give it a bit more time. I see. Well, I won't stop you. Be careful, though. <laughs> You're a kind man, Kiryu-san. Thanks. They call me Ida Maja. Rumor. Magnificent mushrooms. Kima Kimajama's your man. Be around, man. Got a friendship meter? Oh, curious on. I got more. I got more shrooms. Oh, I didn't buy them off of them. Oops. That's okay. We'll come back around. All right. Uh. Or two next. I should have like a bunch of them open right. Yeah, we got that one. I could do that one. That one's pretty. F that one's pretty funny. Let's do that one next. Actually, <laughs> I'm just remembering it. I'm like, oh yeah, wait, that one's actually really good. Cause we'll do this too. Oh hi there, curious son. Ben, if I do another stop and search, you have the stamina and royale. How about this? <laughs> About as safe as it gets. Doesn't look like you're carrying anything dangerous. Here, take this back. Thanks for your co your cooperation is appreciated, curious on. Where did you join the police anyway? Huh? That was out of the blue. Wanna know why I became a police officer? Well you're all I always just see you here questioning people. It made me wonder if stop and searches are the whole reason you signed up for to the force. I uh um what? This is a touchy subject. Actually, I'm ashamed to admit it, but stops and searches are the only thing I'm good for. I can't do anything else. Huh? What's that mean? When I joined the force, they partnered me with a senior officer. He was great at what he did, and he was really popular with the other officer. He had my back from the very beginning. Very much the ideal cop. Just like the ones you see on TV. I was in awe. Then one day, we stepped into a, stepped in to break up a fight between some drunks. When I pulled them apart, one of them attacked me from behind. My partner moved to protect me, but he got stabbed instead. Must have, a, must have hit an artery. Blood was gushing out. He didn't make it. He had my back until the end, though. <sighs> Ever since, I've been scared to death of real police work. No matter the task, I just end up a nervous wreck. Now the others in the department just see me as dead weight, so I try to stay out of the way when I can. But I spend my days out here doing stop and searches. Questioning people and searching their belongings is the only thing I have. That's all I can do. I'm sorry to make, ramble on like this. Thank you for your help. Mm. He's clearly down in the dumps. Guess I opened up an old wound. Poor guy. Alright. Uh, oh, this way. I heard it. Where is it? Oh, right here. I see it now. You gotta pick up these porn cards. I guess. Oh, there's another one over there. I see it. I don't even need the radar. I saw that one straight out of the blue. What's the password? Dude, stay good hero. Speaking too quietly to catch what he said. Good. What do you want? The usual. That about. Oi. Hey, what are you selling here? What's the password? 
password. First time here. Sorry. Got nothing to sell you. You don't know the password. Your, biz your business you run here. Merchandise is special. The kind that stores don't carry. Get someone to tell you the password if you don't want... If you, if you want to do business. I need a password. If I have no leads on where it, where to get it, this all I'll be forever. This will be forever one, be, ever be one of life's great mm -hmm. mysteries. I got what I need now. That guy bought something. Must know the password. Well, wait, a new ball reach. Hold on. Before I talk to Mr. Password Man. Give me a second. We're going for a ride, Dragon of Dojima style. Go! <laughs> oh my god, he paid me, what the f- He's not human. Oh my goodness. Hey, excuse me. You want something? I saw you saying a password to that, to buy something from that guy. Can I get the password off you? Uh, let's start a- that's what this is about. I could tell you, but you- you'd be okay. Very dangerous, if you know. What do you mean? That risky? Of course. Many friends died to get password. Very, very dangerous. They died? Hmm. All in past. Over now. Hmm. Actually, you look like a strong man. Maybe you can. What is it? Oh, no, it's nothing. Anyway, you want password or no? Sure. Tell me the password. I have to know what that guy's peddling. <laughs> oh, I like you. Stupid. But I like you. Hey, okay. I tell you password, but not free. There is condition. What? A condition? Yes, you do job for me. What is it? It's a simple job. Very easy. I explain now. You listen. You go to Tohai Boulevard East. Find restaurant Yuka Yukute in front. Find woman named Monmon. Monmon. You talk to Monmon, okay? Two things. You ask her plans for today and tomorrow's weather. You got it? Plans for today and tomorrow's, tomorrow's weather. That's it? That's it. You ask her, come back and tell me what she say. See? Very simple. Got it. I don't get what's going on, but... I just have to find Mon Mon and ask her about plans for today and tomorrow's weather for you. Right. You know screw this up, okay? So hi, Boulevard... Is Cuckoo Oak Park Boulevard Hill District the Street? What did I just read? Boy. Oh, yeah. Wait, I confused. I have to find a woman, Momon, in front of Yura. Okay. For that restaurant. 
then. Five Boulevard East. Oh, it, it's right there. Okay. I'm big silly. Yo, some free money at the start of a fight? Let's go. I'll take it. Is that an umbrella? Oh, I gotta wait. Right. I keep forgetting about that. Now I'm good. I don't generate any heat in this style. Holy shit. Oh wait, that's Mr. Shakedown. I earned seven mil. Maybe I should let him beat me. Maybe I should let him beat me, to be honest. Because if I let him if I let him beat me and encounter him again, I'll get I'll get like double the money basically. Yeah, let's see. I just did a tiger drop, by the way. Oh, okay, I failed the tiger drop that time. <laughs> Shit. Okay, build up. Eater Regis down there too, so that works. We'll put on the uh, encounter finder. Oh, I got I know where he is. Or I guess it doesn't tell me on this map killer, but Oh, what? Why did he kick me out? Oh, 
Yeah. Okay, that makes. <laughs> I can't afford to buy any food because of. Yeah. I, you know what? That that makes total sense. Okay, where the heck is Brizzy then? I'll know I found him when uh, I see the right um, thing. Oh, there he is. Okay. My way to him. He was doing a combo, I didn't realize. Maybe another. Oh. Why did I try to grab him? Of course that's not going to work. Gonna hit by shit I should be getting hit by. Oh, that's a Yagami one. Oh, that's cool. Or is that a Kiryu? No, that might, be, that might have been a Kiryu Hida action. We're gonna do it again. It looks like I just... I didn't even throw a SIG at him. I just... I threw a piece of chalk. <laughs> That's funny.
going for a ride, Mr. Shakedown. Here we go. <sighs> I don't know how many times I've seen that action now. But you know what? I like it, because it's funny. A little too greedy, not gonna lie. There we go. Yeah, he, he just doubled that. Holy shit. <laughs> just double that money. Alright, uh, what was I doing again? <laughs> oh, right, so I'm going to, um... Over here. I'm on the right street, actually. Huh? -huh. Those up. There's a woman in front of Yura Kuti. Uh, Yura Kuti. To be Munmon, the woman I'm supposed to find. I have to ask her a couple of things to get the password. Oi. Hey, are you Munmon? I don't know. You. I not know you. What do you want? A couple of things I need to ask you. Yeah. What do you want to know? Was I supposed to ask Munmon? Can you tell me what your f plans for today and tomorrow and tomorrow's weather? Oh, I see. I'm waiting for this. You want to answer? Then you fight first. Really? This isn't what I signed up for. It's okay. I brought my jukebox. Hold on a second, boys. I'm gonna level up. I, I feel like I need this. I feel like there's... I'm fighting in this style and I'm not gaining any fucking heat. <laughs>
<laughs> this is here to prevent the skill tree from awkwardly loop looping, so I touched up. This is a touch up variant of the dragon of, of the dragon style is pleasure for people to play with. Be sure to check out my Kawami mod. While this game is not necessarily needed, he did this. That game certainly did. <laughs> he in nineteen ninety five. That's pretty funny. AKA don't don't buy this node. Grant super armor of fifth gear. Oh my goodness, yes. I didn't have many additional skills to insert into the dragon style tree. They may become real skills in the future. But this also may not but so they they also may not. I would also consider this is a good place to tutorialize some of the tech, technical attributes. That's something I can buy. I don't know if I should buy that one though. Kamaki will four sleep. What I would what I want actually is that is that dodge roll. Yeah, this one. You do a quick step and then you and then you do the dodge roll. Is very good. What are these? Uh, hers. Finishing holds. Yeah, we'll buy the we'll buy the counters actually. Okay. Good. Oh, I'm feeling much better now. God damn. Much faster, much stronger, building up heat. Let's freaking go, dude. That's what I'm talking about. Ooh, you're very strong. You passed us. I gave you information, tough guy. Good. All I want to know is your plans for today and tomorrow's weather. Oh, yes, yes. The plans for today are movie date. Tomorrow's weather is rain at noon. Okay, got it. Movie date and rain at noon. You say hello to Lei Huang for me, okay? Li Huang, who's that? Li Huang, when you sent you here? Sneaky man, usually near shopping area. Okay, yeah, that sounds like the guy. <laughs> Li Huang is a tough boss to work for. Not e not so easy for you. Huh? He's not my boss or anything. <laughs> it's okay, I discreet. You don't have to keep secret from me. What are you talking about? Very good. You good acting. Li Huang, uh, Li Luang, clever man. You always find good people to work for him. I like you. Hope you not die. Good luck. I didn't expect a brawl, but Mon Mon told me to about plans for today and tomorrow's weather. I have to get back to the guy for the password. He should be, yes. Movie date and
God damn, that's fun. I also actually need to buy the rest of the styles too. I I haven't actually capped these ones out yet. They all cost a bit too much, because uh, I spent all of it in the Dragon Dragon of Dojima one. Yo, you asked one mom plans for today and tomorrow's weather. Yeah, I don't get what it means, but I got her answer. Oh, very good. First, what mom won't say about plans for today? You said a movie day. Okay, movie day. Got it. Okay, how about tomorrow's weather? What mom won't say? The rain at noon. Oh, rain at noon, I see. Okay, good work. You bring me mom on answer. Big help. Sure, you didn't tell me about a fight. Get mom on to talk, though. That would have been good to know. Eh, all part of job. That's why I asked you in first place. <laughs> you quite useful, man. I'm impressed. By the way, what was that about? What do you need to ask mom on about her plans for today and tomorrow's weather? Think I tell you? No chance. Code words for next business deal. So it was for some, some shady deal after all. I figured those phrases didn't, didn't have been taken at face value. Okay, I'm done with your job. Hurry up and give me the password. Patience. I finished deal first. I come back soon. Not take long. You will walk around and wait wait for me. Okay, then. Hmm? Hey, boom, you're back. How did your deal go? Big Mrs. Big business deal go through, thanks to you. Just thank you for you. I have a broken shotgun. <laughs> okay, Jesus. By the way, I'm about that password. <laughs> I know, I not forget. I tell you, you listen careful, okay? Sure, I'm listening. Password is... Dubo Tengigiriko. Important you capitalize first letter. Huh? What's the problem? You see what I mean to tell you, merchantman. Uh, yeah. Can you say it one more time? See, you listen carefully. Okay, I'd be nice. One more time. I say password. Memorize. You say password to merchantman. I hear for a while. I, I forget password. You come back. Got it. I don't think I have to remember it. I know in the PS4 PS4 version you actually have to type it out. But I'm, just, I'm thinking in the PC version, you don't have to actually do that. I hope so, anyway. Cool. It's okay, jukebox time. want to buy. Say the password. I have to tell them the password I got. Good. That's it. Sweet. I got it. <laughs> I got the password. <laughs> I finally managed to get the password right. Didn't expect to be become a go-between for a shady deal to have to get it, but it turned out alright. 
That was a lot of work just to satisfy my curiosity. Now, what am I forgetting? Hey! <laughs> I like how I played, like, the triumphant music and everything. And then he interrupts it by, like, Wait, are you actually gonna buy anything? Hey, aren't you buying anything? Oh. Maybe later. <laughs> I wanted to see what that guy sold. No, actually, I just wanted the password. <laughs> oh, I think he actually turned into a shop. Yeah, I should probably get these. Oh, and a nameless katana? Huh? I'm gonna need those parts for next stream because my god. I think I like there's like some parts in like Don Quixote and stuff and Bisu Pond, so I gotta go there too. All right, um, but these guys. I guess we'll since we're here, we'll do that um, producer side quest. That one's funny too. My heat. It's not hot enough. Alright. Uh. Okay. Oh, okay. Not what I was expecting. Does have a taunt? How do I taunt? Just a curb stomp is all it takes. Let's go. And that's fun. I keep saying that, but I'm not lying. It's just, it's fun. It's fun to fight people in this game. Okay, uh, four? Oh, okay, that's fine. I don't think I've gotten any, I don't think I've used any of my completion points for Majima yet, so I am kind of curious, like, if I don't upgrade the, the, um, get more money from doing street fights, if I don't grab those completion things if I actually get more money than carry you. Hopscotch. Oh! It's okay. I just caused property damage. Don't worry about me. Alright. Oh, hi. Did you come to help us with our location shoot? What to do? Fine. I'll help out. It's not going to take too long. That's great. Thank you so very much. My name is Mori. And it... I'm the director's assistant. This is Kawaguchi, our cameraman. 
Hi, I'm Kawaguchi. Delighted to meet you. I'm Kiryu. Good to meet you. So, what am I supposed to do? Well, the show's producer is supposed to be here, but something came up at the last minute. He can't make it. So, we need you to stand in for him, Kiryu-san. Wait, what? I don't know what a producer does. But isn't that role pretty important? Haha, <laughs> <laughs> no way. You may think that, but all a producer really does is act all high and mighty. It's, total, it's a total fluff job. Is that it? I have no idea what I'm doing, though. People are linked to know I'm fake it. I'm faking it, won't they? Not to worry. Once we get you into some clothes with more executive style, it'll totally pass for a producer. I mean, producers have a look. Hi. They sure do. Let's get you looking like a big shot. <laughs> Oi. Guys, do producers really dress like this? <laughs> Absolutely. You're a picture perfect producer. Isn't that right, Kawaguchi san? Hey. Uh, okay, so what am I supposed to do? Well, director is on the way, and we need you to deal with him and keep up with his demands. He can be, uh, kind of a diva. He always. Does some weird stuff, but try not to set him off and you'll be fine. I'm having second thoughts here, but I'll see what I can do. Producer Kiryu. This is a great side quest, by the way. It's, it's even a side quest line. It keeps going, actually. Be here any minute now. Oh, a director's here. Here he comes, Kiryu-san. You're up. Try to act natural. Act natural, got it. <laughs> Ciao, lovelies! Good morning. Mori chan! Guten Morgen, baby! Oh, good morning to you, too. Don't have a change, Mori san. I'm cutting on you today. Bling, bling, cha ching, baby! Huh? What in blazes? Where's our intrepid producer? Where's my idiot chan? Sorry, idiot chan called in sick this morning. Kiryu's on here will be standing in for him today. Kiryu? Never heard of him. The real deal, baby. Yes, of course. Kiryu's on does a lot of work on location overseas. This is his first domestic shoot in a while. That's probably why you don't recognize him. Well, very well then. De la vie. <laughs> yeah, I don't care who you are. When you're on location with me, everyone has to pull the weight, capiche? Kiryu san, this is our director, Papillion Kato san. Uh. I'm Kiryu, good to meet you. Uh. Mm, he's stiff and s stiff as a stiff. You drag this guy out from the river, boys. I guess what they say is true. People in the television business do seem to be pretty shallow. This guy is irritating, but I better play along so he doesn't uh. get suspicious. Got a problem, Kiryu? If you can't return a simple greeting, you're a history in the biz lab. Figures. Proper greeting is important in every walk of life. What should I do? <laughs> We're getting goofy, baby. When in Rome, I guess. I have to do this right. Hey, hey Poppy Chan! Let's, let's get this shoot rolling so we can wrap up for my next meeting. Chop, chop, yeah? I love it! Didn't expect that from you, Kitty chan But I dig it. Today's gonna be a bada bada big. I guess that went well. Oi. So anyway, what are you babbling a bit of the window dressing? She's on the deck for our dining report. Window dressing? That TV jargon. Yes, about that. Our reporter, Asagawa-san, is running a little late. Yeah. And then why the fuck are we here? It was our job to lock down the talent, and you did that, didn't you? So sorry, I forgot that her schedule in time. She's on her way right now. You're incompetent imbecile. 
If we go over time, we'll be screwing over the restaurant. You're a nice guy, Mori, but this shit doesn't cut the mustard. I'm sorry, sorry. This director. What a change from that cheesy goofball a few seconds ago. This guy's got one short fuse. Oh, here she comes. Sorry, sorry I'm late. No problem, baby doll. We're patient as pie. Oh la la, don't you look ravishing today. Oh, Kato-san, don't be silly. Okay, gang, let's get this party started. Do vo pla. People pla. People play, like French. <laughs> Fantastico! Yo, to your marks, everyone. Let's roll it. Oi. Bon Dieu, what the hell is this? Where's our erasable? Oh, sorry, we'll get it. Sorry, Kiryu-chan. Can you grab the erasable from the table and bring it over here? Erasable. I can check what's on the table. That's a start. Uh, sure, hold on. <laughs> There's some pretty random things on this table. Which one do I take? Erasable must have something to do with the props. Raceable is this. Boy. Hey, I brought the erasable. Thanks, curious on it. Send it to the table if you would. Got it. <laughs> well, that looks tasty. Doesn't it? I want you to savor it now. Let it linger on your l luscious lips. This shot will be my tour de force. Thanks, and sorry for making you bring it over, curious on. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Boy, curious on, I'm sure glad you figured out erasable was our what our crew calls consumable props like food. Uh, yeah, I figured that food is a race when it's eaten. Really it. This shoot's going smoothly, thanks to you. I managed to be useful somehow. How the fuck did I do that? <laughs> oh, that looks so that looks delicious. There's so much. And it looks pretty so tasty, so I could eat it all in one sitting. Good. The shoot's going along smoothly. Pardon me, Kiryu-chan. We still We do still have life in that erasable later. So would you be a doll and grocer it for me? Oh, uh sure. Grocer the erasable? What could that mean? It's a grocery clerk. Put the food on an angle. Grocery it, huh? I got this. <laughs> That's looking like a great grocery shop if I do say so myself. Hey, I grocered it. Brilliant. Thank you, Kiryu chan. Let's take a look. <laughs> Big defeat. Your erasable is angled like a grocer's display. When you're a grocer, it probably means tilted in an angle, like how a grocer displays produce on the shelf. It's easy to film uh, still life that way, but you knew that, of course. Huh. Yeah. And managed to get it right. Thank you for the wonderful meal. It was delicious. It's almost done. Sorry, Kiryu-san. Can I get you to jeer, the, jeer these props? It's about time to strike no, the set. Just chew these props and strike the set, mate. <laughs> Punch the dishes. I got this. <laughs> Taunting them is pretty funny. Come on, dishes, what you got? What you got? Come at me. Taunt them. <laughs> Thank you, Curious Out. I'm glad you do that jeering means putting the props away when you strike the set. <laughs> it was obvious. This way we can clear out as soon as the filming's done. That's smart thinking, Curious Out. You're looking 
a head to whatever it needs doing. I'll hail the best, world's best producer. Uh, yeah, right. No, seriously, you're really helping us out. Looks like I got that right. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. Thank you. That's a wrap. Let's blow this popsicle stand. It's over, I guess. He was just there. He was just there. <laughs> I wonder if I wonder if nowadays, like when when people are making films, if they still use this lingo. Or if they even use this lingo at all, I have no idea. Here you son, you saved us. You know showbiz lingo like a pro. Huh, no problem. I had fun with it. That was something else. It's rare to see a producer who can take charge on a location like you. Please accept our thanks. Magnetic necklace? You have all the mar makings of a great producer, Kiryu-san. We would love to have you come back sometime. What's going on here? Producer Edia. This should go down okay without a real crew. The producer? What the devil? Why do you even bother showing up? <laughs> needed, you needed it on a teleprompter. We're here to beat some manners into you. This is, this is for working us like slaves, late into the night. Who are you to tell? Who the hell do you think you are? We got broadcasting because we got into broadcasting because we love television. Thanks to you, we don't got no time to go home and watch TV. That's the way to live. What can I say? It takes blood, sweat, and tears to make a TV show. Fortify, gentlemen. Hmm. Big, <laughs> Big Talk is always director. Who made you look so important that you can treat a producer like this? I've had it with you. That's why we boycotted the shoot today. We're on strike. Boycotted? More like you let your personal drama get in the way of work. Call yourself professionals? Yep, all you want. This is the last time we'll ever see you. Let's end this shit show on a happy note for us. Shit. Oh my gosh, what will we do? I got this. Huh? huh? Curious, son. Hey, hold it. Huh? Oh, who the hell are you? My name's Kiryu. I'm the producer here. I can't people have people harassing my crew. Kiryu-san. Or Kiryu-chan, I... Wait, you're my replacement? You just doubled my fun. I'll show you how irreplaceable I truly am. Come on, boys. Let's see what this faker first. Start the jukebox in three, two, one. You messing with a dragon? Come here, bitch. Oh my goodness, what? Yo, that was fucking awesome. Oh! Ow. Maybe that was a- maybe that was the fourth bar? Jesus. That was a sick heat action. Did they pull this guy off of a bodybuilding show? Forget this. Here you son. All right. Uh, yeah. Thanks a million, Kiryu Chan. Hmm. Yeah, that's at least an amateur like me can do. So you were faking it after all, Kiryu Chan. You? <laughs> I'm no fool. I knew something was off the moment we met. You were a fish out of the water from below. Hmm. Huh. Couldn't fool a pro after all. But if you knew, why didn't you get rid of me right away? Because Kiryu Chan, you did the best you could with such passion, despite not knowing a damn thing. TV is not a gentle mistress. 
a single a single minute or even seconds of footage. It takes dozens of dozens to hundreds of hours of hard work. The struggle is, as we say, real. The challenge demands an incredible level of precision, experience, and skill. But there's something even more important than those, and that one of me is passion. Passion. I believe TV gets the viewers viewers' hopes and dreams. And people out there who can be inspired by TV to do their jobs, or even their way of life. I think TV is a medium that has the power to change people's lives for the better. You might be right about uh. that. Well, Steph. That's why we make programs with passion, no matter how hellish the process may feel. As creators, we are we are the dream weavers. It is our duty to pass those dreams on to others. You're quite a director, you know that? <laughs> yeah, piss posh. It's an over I'm just an overbearing loser who can't even hang on to a solid crew. I wanna keep that I wanna bring the same passion I have for work out at, out in them. But I can never seem to get through to them. Yeah. Dr. Kato, what you just said, a movie to my core. You have a lot of growing up to do. Do I want to do more? I want to make better programs. I want to create shows that bring people joy and inspiration. I want to channel our passion into to the art of film. So please, we want you to keep a, keep on us like you do. Guys. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sounds like you got through to them, don't you think? They get your old-fashioned sense of passion. Kiryu-san. Thanks. kiryu chan Thanks. Honestly. You really are a great producer. You, you won't stop giving us hopes and dreams, right? Ah. On contraire, mon fier. We'll show you dreams if you even come to see mine's eye. Okay, boys. Production meeting. Let's drill down to plan for some better shows from the top. What? We just wrapped. Have mercy. <laughs> the heck does from the top mean? <laughs> That's a great way to end that one, Kiryu. Good job. What the hell does from the top mean? Okay. Um, With that... I think that one continues... Oh, is it down there? No, that's something else, isn't it? Oh no, maybe that is it. Okay, that's that's it. Oh, that's my guy. I'm like, I'm trying to fight my own dude. <sighs> okay, maybe I didn't need to do that many strikes. Okay. Uh, what is this? Oh, tough us up. I'll use that, sure. Sure, whatever you say. Okay, what else we got here? These are all these are all billions, so I might have to wait to grab those. Increase the power of heat actions again. Uh boost the power of heat actions even further. I'll have enough for it actually. What about the ones down here? Firmly increases the iframes of your quick step. 
A non heat move counter throw option handed down from to the sacred skulls as teaching of the Chinese material master. Oh, the lotus counter throw. Oh, it says I have it acquired. So I don't actually need to buy this one. Let's. These are acquired too. Also, I spent my money on this for no reason because these are actually. I have these already. These ones I don't, though. This one, apparently, I have. After vigorous training, much much attained wisdom, Kiryu gains the dragon speed he becomes known for. This says I have it. A but I can still spend money on it, so that's... But wait, I... Okay. Okay, I'm a, a little bit confused. Just a little bit. Boost the speed at which you adjust, adjust your hold on an enemy. Weapon master defense. Let's grab the, uh, let's grab this. Next step iframe. If we can't buy anything for 400k uh beast mastery throwing or spirit adds a fourth adds a fourth gear to the beast style enabling cyclones thing in third Beast style can go up to four, four bars. Only have two hundred k on me though, so I can't. Increases the speed of regular attacks and the power of heat actions when you rush them. Increases the speed of regular attacks and power of heat actions due to rest style. Here invokes so the spirit of the wind. Putting regards. Combo. I don't think I'll be able to thing here. I need I need I need a ton more money. Brawler's actually almost done. That's pretty sick. Okay. Oh, that's... Okay, that's what I thought it was. Alright, I'm not... We're not doing that. <laughs> we're not doing that one. No, thank you. Uh, is there a way for me to run past it? I guess we'll just... I did say we would do side quests, but I don't know if I want to do... That one on stream. <laughs> Same thing with this one. I don't know if I want to do this one on stream either.
Okay. Sorry, you have a knife. That's not very safe. Does your knife beat bowling ball? I thought not. Hi, right, Mr. Shakedown. Oh, hey! 171k? I don't know if I need to fight him, to be honest. I don't know if I need to fight him. Uh. Oh, no, no, no. Here it is. That's where this quest line continues. We'll go. We'll do that. I enjoy it, actually. I really like this one. Fight these guys first. Goons! It's the Goon Squad. Boom. Send him packing. Oh my gosh! Mm. Wait, you're kidding, right? Come on, don't tell me you're kidding. Come on, just tell me. What are they talking about? Oh my god! It's like you and I watch different new watch news from a different planet. I swear. Okay, I'll take pity on you. Prepare to be enlightened. The pop star prince is coming here to Camarocho. Oh wait, do you mean Miracle Johnson? None other. It's unbelievable. Yet 100% true. He's coming to Kamarocha to shoot a new music video. Whoa! Miracle what now? Get this. He's supposedly in Japan already. Word on the street is that he got... He's, there's been some kind of problem, though. Doesn't matter. I'll get Miracle's autograph. No matter what. I want to see him, too. Hope they solve the problem so they can start filming soon. That's why I've been hanging around here, to keep my eyes open. Some of the production staff could be nearby. I guess some global star named Miracle is here. And his crew run some kind of... Uh, run into some kind of problem. Whatever. Oh, hold on. Uh-oh. Do I need to restart the... I might have to restart the game. Okay. Uh, give me a second. No. Oh. Oh. Okay. I think we're back. I don't have to restart the game. That's fine. Fight me, boys. We're okay. Excuse me, sir. Attacking me from behind. That's incredibly rude of you. Oh, that's my- why am I trying to fight my own dude? What the fuck? Yeah. 
Okay, uh... Am I Monoraj, aren't they? No. I think I just have to walk in and out. Over here, we're... We'll order some food. You made the thing. But, um. Maybe it is going up by Madaraja. Let's see. I think I will take a save here, though. Where, where is it? Okay, there it is. What's up? Okay. Uh. Oh no, maybe I was wrong. How do I find that so far? Okay. Where? Where is this guy? Oh, excuse me. I need to look for Poppy, I think. There we go. Found him. Mm -hmm. Oh, kitty chan Ciao! Mm. Hey, it's been a while. Still making shows that bring hopes and hopes and dreams to people's lives. <laughs> oh ho! Oh ho! Is it for you to say, big Mister Producer? Huh. Listen, I've got a chance here to drive viewers bananas. Not, it's a, not just in Japan, but all over the world. How do you figure? <laughs> You're a real producer after all, Kiryu-chan. A chance to whip out the whole world into a frenzy has got your attention. You know I'm just an amateur, but yeah, I'm willing to listen to your fairy tale. What's going to drive the world yeah. crazy? The crazy thing is, it's no fairy tale at all. What? <laughs> Not enough to give you give, to give a hint for you. Woo! Yeah. What was that all about? 
Here you chat, don't tell me you don't know who Miracle Johnson is. Miracle Johnson. Oh, I get it now. I just heard about it. Some kind of singer, right? Seriously? Kiryu, you, baby! Are you telling me you hadn't heard of the pop star prince until today? He's world famous! Famous to the world, maybe, but this is Kamurocho, Japan. Why should that matter? Kamurocho is part of the world- Fine, fine. It's- that's not important. Say la vie. Basically, Miracle is in Japan for his, to shoot a new music- his new music video, but this is strictly hush-hush. There's been a little problemo holding up the El Shuto. If you catch my drift. Yeah, you're saying there's a problem. Yes, and I'm convinced there's only one man capable of solving that problem. That's you, Kiryu-chan. You... I've been looking for you everywhere. Can't go into the details, because it's a top-secret mission. But will you be willing to help? We'll set the world ablaze, you and me. Fine. Let's hear it. Now you're talking! That's what makes you an ace producer. So what's the problem? It's the pop star himself, actually. Miracle's refusing to perform until his demands are met. We're at a standstill. What? Is the guy being a diva? No, actually. He's just really insistent on doing the music video exactly right. And he won't compromise. What's this music video about? To be honest, I don't really get it. Apparently, it involves Miracle dancing through a horde of attacking zombies. Zombies? Yes, but if they really were to... They were to really attack, you could get hurt. So, we told the extras to take it easy on when they swarm them. But Miracle got the wind of that and blew a stack. He says zombies have to attack like they mean it. Otherwise, the action won't feel real. So he's refusing to do it. There's a lot I don't get here. Like, how can a zombie feel, video feel real to begin with? Who knows? These Westerners, man, these... They're so cra- They're so crazy, but it's gonna be a surefire hit, surefire hit if it happens. Well, I understand the problem now, but I don't get- What I don't get is how I fit into the thing. You're the man to keep Miracle safe from the zombies, baby. You want me to protect him? Yeah! For the sake of realism, the zombies are going to go all out to attack Miracle and try to get him and everything, but we can't let that happen to the pop star prince get hurt. Now this is where you come in, my old friend. Sounds like a strange gig, but it seems simple enough. Of course, of course. This is the perfect job for you. Isn't it just the perfect job for you? Let's go get the deets from the music, de music video's producer. Or director. Uh, sure. Finally got the man for the job. Oh, it's you, Poppy. <laughs> Sorry to keep you waiting. Introducing the powerhouse producer with the biggest biggest brains, bronze, and balls in modern mass media. Here's Kiyu-chan. I'm Kazuma Kiryu. Good to meet you. Oh, so you're the famous Mr. Kiryu. I was told about your... That you, I was told you have an extraordinarily cool aura. I see it's true. I'm Mr. Spining, the director. Welcome to our team, Kiri Mr. Kiryu. This <laughs> is like, this is awesome. <laughs> you mean Mr. Spielberg and Michael Jackson? Yeah, okay. Oh, Mr. Kiryu, let me also introduce you to my new to my PA, Lewis. He's on the team too. <laughs> Howdy! Welcome to the family. Good to meet you. Oh, good to meet you. So, cutie chan is this blowing your mind or what? I'm sure you know already, but just in case. This man here is none other than the director of the massive worldwide smash movie hit Indian Jeans. India what? You're breaking my balls here, cutie chan Are you a hermit? How do you not know this man's films? Sorry. Mr. Kiryu, perhaps you're more of a sci-fi guy. Oh, right, Kiryu-chan, have you... You have, you have to know about this one. A.T., you know, about the boy who rides an alien on a unicycle over the moon. Yo, what's up, Flooper? Uh, sure, I 
Guess I might have heard about it. <laughs> you see? I knew, even, I knew even you had to know. Mr. Spining is an amazing director, right, Kiryu-chan? Right? So um, yeah. Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> it's no big deal, honestly. I thought it was... I thought, thought it was number one in a... Uh, number one at the box office worldwide. There it was. How are you doing, men? Spent the day putting in a new motherboard and CPU, rebuilding your water cooling system, but all set up and your programs redownloaded. Nice! Got, you got you got your um, PC with more powerful stuff? That's always good. Nice little upgrade. So, Mr. Spining, with you at the helm of this music video, are we anticipating another worldwide hit? More powerful stuff, yes. Hell yeah. That's good. I, I'm i thinking about doing mine around, like, next Christmas or so. I would like... Because cause the way that my friend... Because my friend built my PC. The way that he set it up is... He he does the motherboard, the RAM, and the... Um, and the cooling system, I guess. All in one go. Like, I can still keep my 3080, which I bought recently. And then, or I think it was a 30, actually, not 3080, 3060, I think. Or 3070, it was one of, the, one of those. And then, and then, yeah, basically, three of my components, I gotta buy three of them to do, do a massive upgrade to my, to my thing. I, I think it's CPU, um, motherboard, RAM. Those three things are all at once. Uh, absolutely, the fans all over the, all over the world are waiting for this one. I don't know what. I don't want to waste any more time, but I need to confirm one thing. Did I, I describe your mission? Uh, Is that okay? Sure. It was a birthday gift for myself. Oh, nice! Happy Happy birthday! I forgot that your birthday was a little bit ago, wasn't it? Happy belated, Looper. We're here to film Miracle Johnson's latest music video. You understand what that means? The, wor uh, the whole world is going to be watching. Clever boy. But that's only half of it. The full answer is that this has to be the most exciting music video ever made. Failure to achieve that is unacceptable. No fails here, yeah. Wow, that's heavy. You have to hand it to Hollywood. Uh, it never worked on a scale that we can only dream of. Don't you agree, uh, Uh, Yeah, it's huge. Good. I'm glad you get the picture. Hey. hey guys, Mr. Johnson is ready to enter the room. Oh good. Sounds like Miracle's about to join us. Let me introduce you to him. Hey, come on in, Miracle. Uh -huh. Still in the show. Ooh, get him. Hey. Ooh, get him. Luckily all my scenes and stuff for streaming. For streaming program is stored in the clouds. Oh yeah, that would have been that would have been awful to to grab all that stuff again. And yeah, that is a good thing. I'm assuming you use uh you use Streamlabs then. I use OBS, so I would have to if I were to do that. Yeah, if I were to do that I'd have to remake everything, but I, I have a general idea. If I were to I don't need any storage. I, I already have like SSDs and stuff. So if I were to upgrade my PC, I don't need to buy any storage. Uh, hey, Miracle, looking looking right as ever. You know, it's my. Uh, can I do an MJ voice? I have no idea. I don't even know what he sounds like, actually. I, I do listen to Michael Jackson music from time to time, but like just regular speaking voice? I don't know. You know, it's. Uh, isn't it like, kind of like Mickey? Not exactly, but like... You know it's fighting? I was born cool. I'm sure. Born to do it, yeah! Hey man, you my partner? No. <laughs> Curious answer. Here you, John. What are you saying? Of course you're partners. Just grab your cards and say, hee hee! Oh, there you go. Yeah, there you go. that's the setup for that. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh! To the music. 
Here, Cole. That's Mr. Kiryu, your partner today. He's a little shy. Okay, okay, no problem. I heard about Japanese people being shy. So well, that's just human nature. It's all good. Hehe. <laughs> <laughs> Um, here are you. Glad to meet you. Woo! And I'm Miracle Johnson. Nice to meet you. Uh, yeah, likewise. Hey, man. Hey, man. Have they told you about the mission yet, Mr. Yeah. Kiryu? Uh, a little, but I don't get it. I could use some more info. Oh, okay, since you're all here, I'll explain what's happening. The setting is here, Kamarocho. One of Asia's no. One of the world's most uh, one of the world's premier entertainment districts. Zombie hordes suddenly emerge to attack Miracle on the street. Miracle evades the attacking swarm and dance and his dances and dances his way through the land of the rising sun. Every the very picture of cool. It's a tableau a tab tab fuck, I can't read. <laughs> it's a tableau truly truly befitting of our pop star prince. That's gonna be funky, yeah! Woo! Hey, so why zombies? I still don't get what's going on. Apparently they're really into that thing, sort of thing overseas. I mean, if it's a... If a big Hollywood director is behind it, it's gonna be a new trend, I think. I think this city's fabulous. It's always glitters and shines. I love it here. Kamarocha is like an amusement park. Yes, and once the stage is set for a close encounter of the undead kind, Miracle will spin and weave his hey. magic dance. Mr. Kuryu, this is where you come in. Your job is to escort a Miracle to protect him from the Walking Dead. I was told extras, told the extras playing zombies to attack me, like they mean it. If the danger's not real, the thrill isn't either. I tried to stop him. If the pop star prince were injured on set. The whole world would be screaming for my head on a stake. That's really bad. Who's bad? Oh my god. <laughs> I didn't realize you said that. <laughs> it's because I'm bad. I'm bad. I'm really, really bad. Who's bad? No, no spying. I told you I'm serious about I'm how serious I am about this. Compromising the only my artistry would be a betrayal of all my little fans. A miracle. Oh. You're the ultimate entertainer. Yeah! Oh, oh stop spining. Oh, stop spinning. Spining. Whatever. E that's nothing. The whole world doesn't already know. <laughs> I'm sorry about this, Kiryu chan. I feel responsible. No, it's alright. I know it's not your fault. <laughs> so, here, there you have it. You under, under, surely understand now. What part of that was understandable? Whatever, let's just start filming. Oh yeah, Kiryu, I like that fire. You're gonna rock my world with passion like that. That's enough. <laughs> That's the spear, Kiryu. Hold on to that anger, let's roll him. We're going in! Woo! All right, here we go. Does it hop straight into it, or do I have to? I think there's a cutscene beforehand. Yeah, yeah, okay. Miracle, and Kiryu, let me explain what you have to do. Miracle, you unveil your new miracle walk dance, shimmy and shake your way for the end of the street. I know you know this, but please try to keep it elegant. No problem. This dance is gonna bedazzle the so world. Mr. Kiryu, your job is to protect Miracle from the zombies by whatever means uh, necessary. Yeah, got it. Uh huh. Sounds good, Kiryu. Oh my God, I've just I just broke into Mickey. Oh. That's not what he sounds like though. Uh huh. Good, Kiryu. You're the man. Samurai. Let me get on with this. Alright, let's do this. I might need a couple of seconds though. Don't attack him. Wait! No! 
I'm loading my heat actions. Yeah! Oh man, what was the name of this song again? It's so good. These zombies have a lot of money on them. Like Fu! Oh. I think that's it, right? Aw, oh, damn it, I wanted to do the- I wanted to show you the bike heat action, that's amazing. He literally drops the bike, gets on it, and just runs up the guy's face. It's fun. Excellent! Amazing! Magnificent! That was stupendous miracle! I can tell right now that I just shot the greatest music video of all time. This will be the stuff of legends. Spining, please. I only did what was expected of me. Real honor goes to cure you. He was cooler than ice. So cool. Too cool. You're right. Kiryu, you, if it weren't for you, this masterpiece would have never happened. I gotta edit out blue. <laughs> That's all I have to do. <laughs> When I played Judgment and Lost Judgment, you're the master of bike foo. But bikes, literally, I I I made a TikTok from one of my streams and like, uh, one of, one of the guys had a knife, and <laughs> he had a knife, and I'm like, you don't fucking bring a knife knife to a fist fight. What do you what do you think you are? I'll tell you what you can bring though. And I I picked up a bike and wrecked him. <laughs> the best. From the bottom of my heart, I thank you. Yeah. No need for thanks. Beating down hostile guys seems <laughs> like it's part of my daily life, daily routine. Like AOE win. Hell yeah. Hey Kiri, would you like to be my personal bodyguard? You'd be like another part of me. <laughs> Here you baby, this is it, man. The golden ticket. The pop star prince is recruiting you. Maybe sitting a superstar might be a decent life. But the world is too big, too big a stage for me. Kamurocho is plenty big. Aw, oh. oh, how disappointing. But I guess I can't deprive Kamurocho of, of its star. 
That's the way you make me feel, Kiryu. Kiryu chan! Very well. I'll leave you with a gift then. Hey, zombies, come on! Black, black or white? Just tell me. A large black box and a small white box. Black or white? What should I pick? Um, I know that the second one of these, like, not this quest, but the next quest, I think was, I think it was holding something important, but I don't remember which one you're supposed to pick. I'll just pick black for now. Okay. Black. Okay, black it is. I give to you. These, are you sure? Aren't these expensive? Silent shoes. <laughs> you think money like matters to a superstar like me? I guess not. I accept these gratefully then. Thank you. Thank you, Kiryu. Everybody sticks. Thank you, Kiryu. You're going to be the Kamurocho King. I can tell. After all, I'm the pop star prince of the world. Hey. Woo! Hey, hey! <laughs> I still don't really get your American group. But it was thrilling experience all the same. At least I'll never have to fight zombies again. Zombie Majima would like to have a word with you. From the future. Samurai. If I'm ever back in Japan, I'm gonna look you up, Kiryu. You wouldn't mind, uh, would you? I'll think about it. Hey, Miracle. We better get going. The world needs to see what we've got waiting for them. Looks like my time is up. I'll see you around, Kiryu. I gotta... Feeling this isn't the last time. Sure. I look forward to it. Don't have to fight zombies again, my boy. <laughs> Miracle Johnson thinks we'll meet again. Huh. Maybe we will. <laughs> I forgot Kiryu made that. Whoa! <laughs> That's awesome. Yay! We did it! There's a continuation to it, though. I'm gonna do a save before I, uh... Before I do it. What's the big scoop you got? I got some good news and some bad news. Which one you want to hear first? Bad news first, then. Miracle's gone missing! What? What do you mean, missing? Are you nuts? Keep it down. They hear you, they'll kill us... Kill us both to keep secret from leaking into the paparazzi. Whoa, sorry. This is serious stuff. The whole world is an uproar. Because the pop star prince has gone AWOL. Makes sense. He's a global superstar. Hope he's alright. Anyway, so what's the good news? I saw Miracle. The missing pop superstar. What? You're pulling my leg. Where? I told you, keep it down. If the wrong person hears us... They'll grind us into hamburger meat. Sorry, sorry. So where? Mataraja. I saw him going with a security detail. I bet he's traveling incognito. Oh, yeah, I get it. He's on private visit to Japan. <laughs> Bingo. Too bad the security guards have Mataraja locked down tight. No getting past them. Oh, yeah, I guess not. Hmm. How am I gonna get in? Miracles at Mataraja. It's just a rumor, but maybe I'll take a look if I'm in the area. There's no maybe, Kiryu. This is only do. Okay, we're gonna... toss a save down real quick, because I want to make sure that I get the right item from this quest. I think it's like another... It might be another encounter finder. Right? Or trouble finder, rather. I think you can get the trouble finder twice for Kiryu, I guess. Because, like, I got one from the, uh, the Marasa minigame thing. Or did I get it from. No, I got the encounter finder somewhere else. I think that was where I got the trouble finder. I think this is another way to get that same item. 
I forget, but I am going to once again toss a save. And we're gonna go go to Monterasha. Sorry, civilian in the what civilian on the way. Fight these guys. Didn't you guys hear? I brought my jukebox. I'm gonna need a second though. I gotta wait for my shit to load. Okay, wow. <laughs> yeah, I'm not supposed to know that yet. Oops. I totally tiger dropped that guy. <laughs> Big foreign guy in front of Madarasha. Rumor about Miracle visiting Madaraja might not be wishful thinking after all. Hey! Oh! <sighs> Sorry, private booking. No normal business hours now. Miracle here. <laughs> <laughs> Where'd you hear a bogus story like that? What would a global superstar like Miracle be doing hanging out here? Acquaintance. Give me a chance to say hi. Then I'll be on my way. Yeah, yeah, if some... As if someone like you is a friend of miracles. Get real. So are you trying to lie your way in here? If you're not gonna leave. I'm gonna have to make sure you do. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that again. Whoa, okay. Yo, I got fucking bodied. Holy shit. Gomez, I'm very proud of you. When you do all that real estate, you don't remember how to fight. Especially when you laugh so hard when you hire a chicken. Good knee. Ugh. You're gonna have to kill me to get through here. Bodyguard just doesn't give up. Bodyguard, huh? Miracle is here. That man stands out like a white glove. You can't expect people not to notice. What are you gonna do to Miracle? I told you. I just wanna say hi. I'm an acquaintance. You're lying! Pretty stubborn, aren't you? What's all this noise? You guys demand to see Miracle. What? This guy. Hello, Lewis. Hey. Oh, hey, it's Miss Kiryu. Kiryu be, will be stoked to see you, man. You're Lewis from the video shoot. Miracle is here, isn't he? Yeah, come on, Kiryu. Let's go see the man. Hey. You sure it's alright talking to. taking that guy to see Miracle? Dude, this is the Kiryu, star of Kamarocho. A friend of Miracle Johnson. Wait. So you weren't lying. I'm sorry about that. Don't worry about it. I beat the shit out of you. That's my... <laughs> that's my pay for your insolence. <laughs> hey, you want a gate guarding Miracle with me? We'd be an unbeatable team. <laughs> Thanks. But no. Auto Rush is really close to the public. 
I'm seeing Kevin. I'm seeing Kevin launch that game, and it kind of makes me want to. Is that is that what's happening right now? Is that what? Is he trying to get my attention? I don't know. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Looking sharp as a superstar. Of course. They say he's the one. Huh. <laughs> that he is. Hey. hey, Miracle! Look who's here! It's Kiryu! Ooh! Hey, it's been a while, Miracle. It's been like five minutes. Oh, Kiryu, did you come to see me? Yeah, you can say Are that. Okay? okay, okay. Shy as always, I see. I'm happy to see you. Yeah, looks like you haven't changed much yourself. What are you doing back in Japan? Another video shoot? No way. This is my ninja vacation. A ninja vacation? Buying this place is your idea of keeping things quiet. This is it. Bye. <laughs> Anyway, did you come? Did you? Why did you decide to come back to Japan? Madaraja is my kind of place. It's a wonder. It's a real wonderland. I even may. I may even build one back home. Wait, you're telling me you came out to Japan just to visit Madaraja? Yes, on my private jet. It's a hop, and a skip away. Right, you're the superstar. Huh? There's a superstar of Kamarocho. Now, Kiryu. Are you ready to get your groove on? Dance? Me? Come on, you don't want to dance with me? Hey. He's the king of dance. Actually, I, I faced the king of dance. He, he was in the last stream. Um, except he was an evil billionaire douchebag. I mean, billionaire. Billionaire douchebag. Well, only the best dancers around could get in the world could dance with Miracle. He's the best of the best. Come to think of it, I was too busy protecting you to get a good look at your dance moves during the video shoot. Then shall we? Mm. Uh, sure. Oh. No, no, Kiryu. Can't you see? I need more positivity. I'm all about the excitement. Show me how you really feel. Right. Sorry. I'm about to hit the dance floor with the global superstar. Haha, <laughs> that's a spirit. Let's have fun with this. Yeah. Okay. okay. Break it down now! Time to get funky! Woo! <laughs> Let's do this. Woo! I'm gonna get- I'm gonna get rocked. I'm gonna get rocked. We're gonna play on normal. Oh shit. He did it three times, so I'm getting freaking absolutely rocked by. Oh my god, get wrecked. Get absolutely wrecked. Did you get 10? Did you get 10k? Oh my god! Jesus Louise. Pop star prince. Of course.
Was? Was that the? What was that at the end? <laughs> Here are you. You know how you know how to bust a move. That was seriously crazy fun. I see why you're the superstar. For about a second, I thought I was had a shot at beating you. Boy, was I wrong. No, I I didn't have a shot. I'm stuck at this video game. <laughs> Don't be so hard and tough on yourself. I haven't had this much fun in a long time. You can't be my bodyguard. You'd be fit at, very fit as a backup dancer. <laughs> I had fun too. That was so much fun. I want to com commemorate the moment. Lewis, you're up. Take your pick, black or white. A large black box and a, or a small white box. What should I take? I'm gonna, I'm gonna look it up real quick. Um, give me Google Chrome. Um, Miracle Johnson, Miracle Mataraja. Okay, yeah, so it's the encounter finder. You can get the encounter finder or the tour tour t shirt. So I I'm gonna pick it anyway. This is what I would this is what I would pick if I didn't get it already. From the um from oh the encounter finder. Oh, okay. Who do you take me for? I'm the pop star prince. Yeah, you certainly are. I uh, accept it with my gratitude. Yeah, the the encounter finder. I I had one already. Okay. When I'm around you, Kiryu, I feel like I can never get bored. Maybe even extend my stay here in Japan. What do you mean? Oh, you big time, Kiryu. Feel me, fill fill the world. I want to repay that favor. Think I could do for you. Are you are you sure you could do that? Don't you remember who I am? Oh, it's no problem at all. I'd be worried if I, if what I'd had, I would worry about what I'd have to pay you. There's no way I could afford a pop star. No problem. You'll get the miracle discount. Huh. <laughs> so you still want to be paid, huh? That's fine. I should definitely use your help. He's an advisor. Yay! Samurai. Samurai. Hear you. You're a real good friend to me, man. You're a real, real good friend to me, man. I'm looking forward to spending more time with you. Yeah, of course. All right. What do you say we strike a pose to finish? Huh? But don't be shy, guy. You cannot get all self-conscious at a disco, can you? Good point. All right, let's do this. Aha! Uh -huh, ready? Hee <laughs> hee! Sadly, that's the end of this sub. Uh, the this line of sub side quests. So, they're so good. <laughs> so good. I just wish I was better at the dancing minigame, man. I I feel like I was I did pretty well on an Xbox controller. I, I'm the I've been playing on a PlayStation 5 controller. And like these freaking D this freaking D-pad is not it's not oh, it's not there. It's not all there. Like it works, but it's not as good as it's not as good or as responsive as as this thing right here, as the Xbox One's D-pad. But I uh, I vowed to switch to a PlayStation controller on PC whenever I got the chance. So uh, yeah, here it is. <laughs> All right. Um. Well, we can go into Madaraj and do a quest there. Two hour stream. Honestly, like, I think I made some pretty solid progress today. How many quests did I even finish? I didn't finish that many, to be honest. We did Dame Yankee, Password Protected, The Show Must Go On, Miracle on Tenkaichi Street. We did the Tax Lady last time. We did those last time. Uh, we did. 
That was last time. We did Miracle of Mir Miracle in Mataraja. We did the Mushroom Merchants. Um, Kamarocha visited money bags. Uh, yeah, those are the ones we did. Maybe... Yeah, maybe I'll just end stream for now. Because, um, there's a whole lot more I could do. But I do also want to just kind of relax for the rest of the night. Um... But I appreciate anybody that came in, whether you're in for a couple seconds or you were here hanging out for a bit. Thank you, Flooper. Um, and thank you to all the VOD people. I think, um... I think doing the side quest on stream is not the way to go. Um, maybe I'll just continue the story then. I will do... I think I will do um, Majima's... Like, I will... Uh, it's a, like, the main reason why I wanted to do the side quest was to get the Dragon Style. Um, was there any more Kiryu ones that were like, yeah, I, I like this quest? Um, can I open the map while I'm in battle? Okay. Hey, give me a second. I brought the droop box, guys. Ow. Okay, uh, oh yeah, I guess the only other other side quest that I would do would be this one, um, regarding Igo. Dominatrix one is pretty funny. Which ones were the? This was like the news guy or whatever. Or was that, was that Kawami? I forget what was in Shalak. I also forget what that... I don't know what that one is. Uh, this one's the Dominatrix. Woman being harassed. The friendship with the... Uh, Club Sega person. Kid with the shig frig rap. That one's funny. Um, okay. And yeah, we got the... Got the dad trying to get his... See if we can his daughter or something okay yeah I think I'll I think I'll make a save when I when I make a stream that's like oh I'm gonna freaking do some side quests uh, turns out uh, not a lot of people want to watch that I guess <laughs> but that's okay you live and learn right um oh these guys okay we'll fight these guys we'll save Oh, that's the other... Okay, that's the other thing I want to do. So, I guess we'll do one more stream. I'll make it longer, of course, next time. Um, but I do want to do the... the uh, This pocket circuit stadium. Stuff that's there. Get up, sir. Oh no. You only gave me a million yen. What a pleb. Okay. We'll save instead of the in front of this pocket circuit stadium. And we'll call it a stream here. Bit of a short one. But um But yeah. Uh, once again, thank you, Flooper. Uh, thank you to anybody that came by. Thank you to all of the VOD watchers. Um, 
I, I don't think I thank you guys enough. You guys uh, are legends. <laughs> um, but yeah, other than that, we will uh, be back um, on Monday. Keep an eye on Twitter at Phantom Knight seventy five on Twitter. Uh, that's when I that's where I post all my updates, and uh, we're gonna call the stream. And I want to see who the heckles is strumming right now. Who's doing a thing? Who can we send a raid to? One person raid. That that's not surprising to me. But people uh, streaming Dead Space. Makes sense. Um, go over to. Yeah, I know that's. I think that's where I'll go. It's safe. He he could always use the help because he's the one that helped me, so I gotta help him. The two way thing, you know. All right, boom. Head over to the scoom poop. He's playing Final Fantasy two. Um. You guys have a great night, and uh, we'll talk to you later. Peace.